So uh, a speech for J.J. Warren, microphone one. Good afternoon, Chair. Yeah. My name is J.J. Warren from the beautiful uh, Upper New York Conference, and I am a lay reserve delegate. I want to speak for this motion because I think there are subtleties that can slip through that we may not have been aware are unconstitutional. And for me and the younger generation that is the church now among you and who want to be the church together with you for the future as well, we desire a church that seeks the justice of God, a church that doesn't waste its money on a conference and come out with no decision because it was unconstitutional. The pain that would happen from this crucifixion of putting the nails in our Methodist church, the pain of this death might be worth a resurrection, but I'd like to see first if that can happen together without being called unconstitutional with whatever we decide. So I support this motion to put this before the Judicial Council so that we together can make a decision for the church, hopefully one that ensures that wherever we are, the United Methodist Church continues and allows people to feel their calling that God has put on their heart no matter whom they love. So that is my support. And as someone who has grown up in our church, as someone who is gay and goes to the least religious college in the US, my evangelism on campus has grown. We have brought people to Jesus because they said they have not heard this message before. They didn't know God could love them because their churches said God didn't. And so if we can be a church which brings Jesus to people who are told can't be loved, that's what I want our church to be. And that's the Methodist church that I love and that I want to be a pastor in one day. I want to be a pastor in the Methodist Church because I love our tradition. I love all of you. We are the church together. This is the body of Christ and we are stronger together than we are apart. And no plan to separate us can unite us like God's love. We are the church. We are God's children. Let us be the church together.